Today's episode is brought to you by Extra. There's something familiar about it all. The pieces are painting quite a picture on the wall. We don't need to know it all to know it's real. We don't need to see the world to know exactly how we feel. All I want you to know the difference you have made. Please don't change. Please don't. Don't change. Give extra, get extra with all new Refreshers gum. Now we're getting closer to finding Annabelle. Previously on Red Ruby. Damn it, Mikey, there's something you know you need to tell me. Sorry, it's a trap. What's wrong with you people? Goodbye for now, little prince. You said the house is on Hazel Drive? Don't do anything you're Shut up, Ruby. You're not helping any. They'll come for us, Ian. I know they will. Whose side are you on anyway? safe now. Maya! Come back for us! I promise, Ruby. Okay, anybody got any batteries? I'm on my last two. Great. Mama's not gonna be happy when we get out of here. Yeah, if we get out of here. I can't talk like that. They got Maya out, they'll come back for us. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just cold. We're running out of food and the batteries are dying. Well, I hope you're not afraid of the dark. Why do you have to be such a jerk all the time? You know why. Ian, I told you Maya likes you. And you're her boyfriend. Only because you blew me off. Maya would kill me for even having this conversation. Well? She can't kill you if you're already dead. Hey, Amber. Wanna come play war? Me? Wow, well, sure. Fine, sis. I just need to 
in your wrist a little. since they found Maya. She can't be far. She? The woman who got Maya? I've seen her around Millwood. Why would she be down here? I don't know. I mean, the whole town is probably looking for us. I'd feel better if it was the fire department or someone official. Hey, I mean, we don't know. President Clinton and the National Guard could be looking for us up there. I sure hope so. Something on your mind? Yeah. Oh. They become fast friends, huh? Oh, that's not of us. I'm just, you know, Maya, she wouldn't like any of this. You sure it's Maya you're worried about? Favorite sport team? Blue Jays. Favorite Spice Girl? <laughs> Posh. What about our favorite cousin? <gasps> Guys, his pulse is really weak. I'm scared. This is it. They're never gonna come for us. We're all gonna die down here. We have to keep hoping. It's been two days. If anyone was gonna come for us, we'd know by now. She's right, Maisie. This is it. This is the end. If anyone can hear us, please help us. Pretty please. sandstone rock, and as good as dead. No man could cut through earth so dense. Then how, how did you do it? Because I am no mere human. Where are the others? We, we need help. You're just some old lady. And I'm your only hope. But I can't get you out of here. <coughs> oh. Poor boy. He's barely breathing, please. Our friend Maya, is she safe? I took her safe to her family. Then why can't you help us? Because you're too far down. And he is too far gone. Malcolm, Malcolm, Malcolm. Give him to me. I don't know, I think, I think so. How long 
have we been out for? At least a day, maybe more. <laughs> Malcolm. Malcolm! She killed him. He's dead. We're all dead now, Maisie. Forever. Amazing. That stupid game again? Come on, Amber. Let's go explore a bit. You heard what Claudia said, no exploring. What is she, your mother? Cut it out, Ian. Or what? Or I'll knock you out again. Why do you listen to everything Claudia says? Because she's her only hope of getting out of here one day. We've been down here a year, Ruby. Why do you think she brings us gadgets and books? To distract us. She's keeping us down here on purpose. Don't be silly, Ian. Once we're strong enough, she'll let us up. We're just not yet. You're so naive. And that's four. Pay up, Amber. You've been gone a month. What took you so long? Be grateful, child. Blood just doesn't appear out of thin air. Grateful? You've kept us prisoner down here. We would have been better off like Malcolm. Dead for good. Why can't you just let us go? You wouldn't last a week on the ground. Humans fear what they misunderstand. And what they're scared of, they destroy. Their planet their enemies, even each other. You can't keep us down here forever, Claudia. We've grown stronger, like you said. We can protect ourselves now. This isn't some children's story, you silly little girl. Our kind are powerful when we feed, when blood flows through our brittle bones. But the shot soon fades, and what will you do then? You'll be alone. Vulnerable. A sitting duck. You're lying. You're just trying to keep us down here for yourself. You're a lonely old nag. And one day, we'll make you pay. Ian. What, Ruby? She strung us along for 15 years. We're almost as old as our parents now. But this isn't her fault. That's all right, child. Each is entitled to his own opinion. Maybe in time, you'll understand. Well, that's all we have, you and I. Time. Honestly, Ian, you can be such a jerk sometimes. He's right, Ruby. She's been saying the same thing forever. You just don't want to believe it. She's going to let us go eventually. She has to. Keep telling yourself that. Okay. One day we'll get out of here. I know it. And when we do, she'll pay.
you hear that? Hey! What is that? The rocks. They're moving. You okay? No. Next, on Red Ruby. Are you bothering me, Theodore? Maya? You're dead. 